Goat versus Fish! Yeah. Yeah. Celebration! Celebration of Goat and Fish! Let us get Goat here, let us get Fish! There are Goat and Fish, it is the celebration of Goat and Fish! And Goat versus Fish! And Goat versus Fish! Make some noise for this! Fence sitter, fence sitter, big oh, girl, yeah. what you do? Celebration for you! In the beginning, there was goat versus fish. The goat fish. And goat versus fish said that there should be goat and that there should be fish. There is no alpha or omega. There is no black or white. There is no good or evil. There is only goat and fish and goat versus fish welcome to the verses of goat and fish welcome to the verses of goat and fish celebration celebration for goat and fish yeah. oh it is a special celebration of goat and fish of goat and fish yes you all know the verses of goat versus fish you all know the one true question are you goat or are you fish yes yes, yes. are you goat or fish goat it is a goat. Celebrate this goat. Make some noise for this goat. Make some noise for this goat. And of course, there is the fence sitter that chooses neither goat nor fish. It has the very fence upon it. Boo the fence sitter. Boo the fence sitter. Boo the fence sitter. That is that is what the ones say when they are not pleased. Yes, they say they say boo to one another. Yes, perhaps that is what they say. But goat versus fish brings special verses to you. Brings special verses to you. For goat versus fish encountered one. That is called Michael Allen. Oh. Goat versus Fish met this one that was called Michael Allen. And Michael Allen was such a pitiable fence sitter, such a pitiable fence sitter. And the pitiable one, Michael Allen, said, Oh, Goat versus Fish, Goat versus Fish, why do I have to choose between Goat and Fish? And Goat versus Fish took pity on this one, took pity on this one. Do not ever let it be said that Goat vs. Fish did not take pity on a fence sitter. For Goat vs. Fish did take pity on that one. It was saying it was a Michael Allen one. Was saying it was its uh, birth, b b birthday, b birthday, some verses. And Goat vs. Fish said, on this verses, on this verses, you can be goat and fish. You can be goat and fish on the verses of Goat and Fish. Celebration for Goat and Fish. Celebration for Goat and Fish. not choose between goat and fish on the verses of goat and fish. You can be goat and you can be fish. You cannot be goat fish. If you wish to be a goat fish, then you need to be goat and fish and you need to find one that is fish and goat and together you become goat fish and fish goat. You cannot be goat fish, but you can be goat and fish. So on the verses of goat and fish, on the verses of goat and fish, we sing a song of celebration of goat and fish. Sing with goat versus fish. Sing with goat versus fish. I want to be, be, be God and fish. I want to be, be, be God and fish. I want to be, be, be God and fish. I want to be. Me, God and fish. And so we ask the one true question on the verses of goat and fish. Are you goat and are you fish? This is your chance, fence sitter. This fence sitter is never wanting to choose goat or fish, but now it can be goat and fish on this verses. You need not choose. You can leave the fence on this verses and be goat and fish. Are you goat? And are you fish? As a Mexican, I'm a fucking fence sitter. Yeah! Fence sitter, yeah! still on the fence, still on the fence. Why does goat versus fish even bring you the verses of goat and fish? <laughs> That's what's going to stick on the fence, choosing neither goat nor fish. But this one is always high on the fence, always high on the fence. Yes, let goat versus fish. Not high on the fence, but high celebration, high celebration, celebration of goat and. Woo! Go
curses. 